Anthony K with Sports Fluent, and I have a very special guest today, Tony Delk. You know him from the University of Kentucky, from his career in the NBA. I know him a little bit better than he knows, though. So we're gonna ah. we're gonna start with something, Tony. I don't. I know I'm surprising you with this. I don't know if you know this or not, but you kind of owe me an apology. Uh oh, let me hear this. And I'm gonna tell you why. In 1994, I came to the University of Kentucky as a high school student for a basketball camp. Okay. <laughs> you and Roderick Rhodes were my coaches. Yeah. And you gave me a nickname. You called me out in front of everybody and you gave me a nickname and you called me Hollywood. And you, <laughs> sa- <laughs> and you said everybody at the camp was concerned with, you know, stretching, warming up. And right. Hollywood over here me, was more concerned with his hair, with his shorts, you know, about looking good. Uh, I don't know, maybe you wanted oh, to man. impress Coach Patino. And I, I kind of, right. I, I laughed it off and it was fun. And for a week, everybody called me Hollywood. Right. And that's okay, you would think. However, I went to university in West Virginia and my roommate walked me around campus and we were talking. And as we were introducing ourselves to some people, somebody mm-hmm. pointed at me and said, I know you. And I said, I don't think so. I'm, I'm from Toronto. I've never right. spent any time in West Virginia. How would you know me? He said, University of Kentucky basketball camp, you're Hollywood. (laughs) And from that point on, everyone called me Hollywood, which is a (laughs) terrible, terrible nickname, by the way. No, it's not, man. (laughs) No, it's not, man. Oh, so, but he told the story about I was more concerned with looking good than playing good, which did not help my rep. Well, you know, like I say, it's it's more about the, like I said, it's more about the flashing lights. Right, right. You know, you were more about, you know, it's funny you said it too, because I I do remember the name Hollywood. I was like, man, this kid is so concerned with his looks. And most kids, you know, they just want to come to a camp and play and have fun. But you were like, no, dude, I got to look good. I said, if you look good, you play good. That's what I heard. I, I, t- I took from Deion Sanders, right? If you look good, you feel good. If you feel good, you play good. That's right. Good. Absolutely. Absolutely, man. That's what's up. <laughs>